Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today we're going to be making a paper gun. So the things that you will need is three sheets of paper, scissors, and a glue stick. So to get started, first we have to get one piece of paper. Let me just put this down. Then we fold up ways. Well, I like to call it hot dog way because it kind of looks like a hot dog when you like fold it. Now then you're gonna hold, fold it again hot dog way. So basically the long side up and you're just folding the long side. Now you fold it again hot dog way. Then you fold it again hot dog way. So that's one done. But we need another one. Take a sheet of paper. Then we fold it up. <clears throat> we fold it in again. The same same as this, this one, yeah. So I'm just not gonna explain it because I already did. Then you take the first one you made or whatever one. You gotta make this straight as possible. So it just doesn't fold. So I just like to crease it on the table. It's kind of curved, but it will fix out. Or straighten out, whatever way you like to call it. There you go. Nice and straight. Then you fold it up ways like a hamburger. But this is a really skinny hamburger. <laughs> Now you fold this down like a triangle or like, yeah, just like this. Let me just do it on the other side. So take this, move it over there and fold down. So yes, this is done now. Then we're going to take the other one. If it opens up, it's fine, but you, if you don't want to open it, it up, just crease it on the table. It still kind of opens up. But for this, you're going to see this latch where the papers are. Then you're going to fold this around the latch. Keep on folding it until the end. Then now you're gonna glue it. So you're gonna glue this hatch down. So how should I hold this up? I'm just gonna leave it the way it is. Now we open up our glue stick. Jesus, this is a sticky glue. So then, put some glue on this. Oops. <laughs> then you glue this down. Okay. So when you glue that down, glue this over this. Basically, like this. So you have a like a like a place to put your circle pistol thingy. You 
you can put some tape around it. I'm going to go get some tape so it's more easier. While I get the tape, you can just wait or just skip to the like the next section of the video. Yeah, here's my tape. I just like to add some tape so it has more durability. Because sometimes when you don't have that much sticky of glue. Well, I said this one is sticky. It was the outside part because it was kind of dry. But it's not that sticky. Just make a hole so you know you can slide your pistol like again i'm just gonna leave my scissors just like that so now i gotta do this now i need to find a pencil to do it with here you go i just got this pencil for no reason now i can only fit one in here because it I use small sheets of paper. I don't have A4 paper. Because I always run out of with A4 paper. And because I use it too much, so yeah. That's why I have to use A4 paper. You can do a diagonal way, so it's more longer. I'm going to do that. See, it's so long now. Now then, just gonna add some glue. Try to open this glue up. Now let's just release it a little so the pencil can come out. Good. Nope, nope. Now the pencil is stuck inside. Let me just get it out. Or you can cut it out. But I like to cut it out because you really don't want to make this thing big. If you want to, then use a shorter pencil, not like me. Sorry guys, this is taking a long time. It's really stuck in there. There you go. Got it. So you have this. Let me just take those pieces away because we don't need them. Now just cut it. So now you have one barrel, then you fold it right there, you place this in. So that's a barrel, cut it right there. I cut it right here, I can add two barrels, I think that's the shorter barrel, this is a bigger barrel. Yes, let me just use the tape. You don't have to use tape if you have sticky glue, but I just like to use it for fun. So now you need another sheet of paper. You're just gonna cut up a little tiny box.
are you gonna fold it fold it again so that's gonna be your trigger so that's your gun so that's how you make a homemade gun. So you can just hold it right there. You can make a handle if you want, but it's too complicated to make a handle. So I just like to use it like this. Then I just pull this trigger, then pull it back. It kind of goes in. So you can tape for the part of it up. Like right there really hard. And somebody started reading in the phone so yeah that's your paper gun thank you guys for watching like and subscribe and i hope you liked your paper gun that you made with me and i'll see you later bye